Okay, good day, D. Let's begin reviewing your essay. Okay, this can be much shorter, and you could just begin by saying, copyright laws have always been controversial. Okay, next sentence. I believe that implementing copyright laws is more rewarding and maintaining the current situation. Okay. Here, just say, and that maintaining them is essential for uh, the benefit of society. Okay, this will be proven by examining how, um, you can say here, how such laws provide protection to owners' creative ideas and advantages they bring to the economy. Okay, good introduction. Firstly, unique ideas transformed into music, movies, and novels protected by, uh, you can just say, um, copyright laws is highly favorable for the owner. This is due to the fact that it hinders infringement as copying the work of others could easily be affected. Good. For example, research conducted by professors of Harvard University show that various computer systems have detected and stopped thousands of plagiarized essays passed by university students. This is really compelling as the originality of a piece of writing is preserved. As this example shows, the benefits obtained by the owners of materials protected by the law is unquestionable. Now, just, just one small thing, Dee. Um, here you talk about music, movies, and novels. And here, in your example, you talk about um, the university, the essays of university students. Your study should be consistent with your first sentence. What that means is that your first study should also talk about music, movies, and novels being protected by copyright law. Okay? So that's just a small issue to do with consistency. So just try to make your study absolutely consistent with what you mention in your first sentence of the paragraph. Right. Secondly, just shorten the sentence. Secondly, copyright laws stimulate economic growth and thus benefit the whole of society. Next sentence, this is because both the artist and company gain revenue through sales from different industrial sectors. For instance, okay, just delete that. Sony Pictures, who, is, who are in control of the distribution of patent and songs by Chris Brown, have, have the right on choosing who will be allowed to disseminate good vocabulary, and upload videos in YouTube through system IDs. As such, instead of blocking, some online users are permitted, therefore benefiting the popularity and profitable shares gained through advertisements attached on newly uploaded videos. Good. Thus, the merit on keeping the copyright laws in the economic prosperity... Okay. This, this sentence should instead be, thus... Copyright laws clearly um, are linked to economic prosperity and to the and to society functioning well. Um, I thought this was very good, this paragraph, because it is complex, um, but yet you stay in control of the information and you communicate it clearly. So that's that's very good. Okay, and your conclusion is also very good, in particular your future tense sentence. It is predicted that this phenomenon will continue in the future as it provides credit to the original work of various artists and is economically beneficial. That's a lovely sentence indeed to end with. So D, 
very nice essay, clearly written, your grammar is good, your examples are good, are good and I was particularly impressed with how you chose, a complex, chose to make a complex point in this paragraph and yet you communicated it clearly. Okay, let's move to your, uh, your next essay, the graph essay. Okay, here, it, it would be better to begin a sentence, a new sentence, and say, these age groups are 0 to 24, da 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 and over 50. And then begin another sentence saying the four types of food sources examined are dairy, meats, pulses, and vegetables. Okay, just writing short sentences is a very, very good skill indeed. It just helps to neaten up sentences grammatically. Okay, here just delete from. And the sentence is fantastic. The other sources, can you just say the other calorie sources leveled at 20%, except for, okay, delete the pulses, which um, which say here, which formed only 18% of this age group's calorie intake. Okay, begin this by saying the middle-aged group of males acquired their calorie sources from meat with 50% in total. Good. This is followed by dairy at 25%, then vegetables at 15%, and, pul and pulses as the lowest at only a tenth. Okay, and of their total calorie intake. With regards to those 50 years and above, pulses okay, were the top of choice at roughly 65%. Okay, so very, uh, very good uh, paragraph there. Let's, let's move to the bottom. Overall, it is evident that among four different kinds of caloric sources, one of which has dominated the others. Okay, here just say, just name the one which has been dominant. So overall, it is evident that among the four kinds of caloric sources, dairy or meat is the most dominant choice of men in the UK. Okay, while older men love pulses, it is the least favoured by youngsters. Also, of all the age groups, vegetable has the lowest contribution of caloric in source. Now, this, this concluding paragraph is very nice because you talk about general observations that you've made. And over here, you talk about particular observations you've made. And over here, you just explain um, the graph and the age groups that it's looking at and the calorie sources that it's looking at. So uh, what I'm saying is that this is a nicely structured essay. So excellent work, Dee. I look forward to reading more of your essays in the future and remember to submit your corrections. Thank you very much.